It's bloody unboxing time. Is it? What are we unboxing? Well... Hi. Oh, God. He, you've come up with this business plan for your own subscription box. Yes. I I see these boxes. They look like a, a walk in the park to throw together. And I've got all sorts of stuff which I, I could put in a box. Uh, I don't know what we'd call it. Something like uh, Eli's bric-a-brac ball sack or something like that. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. Or, you know, bollocks, it's my bum bag or something like that. Right. Well, the name will make them stand out yes, amongst the crowds. That is true. There's a niche for that, yeah. So, I'm yeah. Sure. yeah. Wanker um, coffin. <laughs> that's it. That is it. Anyway. Yeah, that's perfect. Yeah, we can get, we can get oh, the name man. later. Nearly 15th of the month, time for the new wanker coffin. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. So this is like subscription boxes, basically. Yeah, that, yeah that's, that's, that's exactly. This is your version of it. Okay. Full of okay. random goods. Random mm. uh, goods. Hand selected. Some, some have food. Oh. Some have vintage toys, don't they? Yeah, and uh, yeah. all sorts of uh, crap. So let's right. get this. Let's get this show on the road. Right. Um, our producers come up with an extremely imaginative Eli box. So that just is a working title. Okay. Uh, dive in. Definitely uh, legit things. Yeah. Eli box. Wow, such delights. <laughs> This exists, madam. That's my favourite. <laughs> fifty pounds. Oh, you're pricing it quite high for fifty pounds. Listen, yeah. people are not going to mind paying fifty quid quality yep. straight up. So. It's sourced personally by me over the years and rummaged out of the bedroom in a panic at eleven thirty this morning. Open the flaps. I, I'm slightly worried here. Oh God, there is some Ooh. stuff in here. All right, I'm, I'm going to go for this first. Item number one, which is <laughs> what the heck is that? <laughs> well. So this is... <laughs> is it a coaster? It's kind of a... Can be. Can be used as a coaster. Okay. So yeah. yeah. Tool. And it's plastic and it has... <laughs> Someone means slayed. Yeah. Some naked tomfoolery going on <laughs> in a Greek or Grecian possibly setting. Um, does he have genitalia? Yes. Yes, he does. Oh, yep. He does, yep. Yes. Uh, this is an X-rated what? bull sack. Yeah. Wow. That, that's astonishing. It, I love the way the woman has cocked her head in the side and gone, oh no! Take Basically, it's yeah. a piece of uh, tourist uh, stuff from Greece. I'm, I'm going to be honest, the nudity thing may cause you a problem, Eli. Probably cutting okay, off well, your, we can always, uh, age um, demographic. Then. We can deal yeah. with that later, but just in terms of the concept, how about that? But, can, but what does it do? It's You can use it as a coaster, it's decorative, and you know, they're the original superheroes. These are from Greek mythology. I don't know why you'd go into battle completely naked. You know? That's how hard he is. Yeah. He's, oh, my uh, skin is my yeah. armour. If he's that hard, he'd have a bigger Johnny. Yeah. <laughs> he looks like he's got a micro phallus. I mean, honestly, I'm not... I mean, I'm not huge, but fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> Come on. Oh, the micro phallus poster. quite a weak item there. Okay. Really? Here we go. Oh, not to worry. Oh, my... What is giddy that? Giddy freaking arm. <laughs> Look at that. Do the hokey-cokey with your friends vinyl sing. There is a vinyl comeback. It is very retro. Yep. Vinyl is on a comeback. Everyone loves a bit of vinyl. Yes. You've got the dance moves on the back. Put your left leg in, oh, yeah, your left, left leg, leg out. And Be a scary snowman and put yourself about. Yeah, how grotty and scary do those snowman look, man? They don't have any legs and That's the first like... lyric is put your left leg in. <laughs> That's like a poor man's cosplay version yeah. of snowman. Yeah, that is awful. And the back of it with this dreadful... This record uh, was a novelty hit, obviously, uh, put out at Christmas. And uh, there's been some controversy over the years because the lead singer sounds a lot like Ian Jury of Blockhead's fame. Okay. And uh, he never confirmed or denied that during his life. So, a bit of intrigue in the box. Right. Yeah, yeah I mean, at least go. it's not naked. So, you know, yeah, so yeah, it's a start. So we've got yeah. no naked men and scary snowmen. Here we go. Oh, look dude. at this! Some noodles! Ramen. Now look at that! What kind of noodle is that? Cheese flavoured ramen. Oh, oh yeah! yeah. Look for cheese, cheese powder mix inside. Of course you're going to look for it, but yeah. you're boil it up. <laughs> it's just been well, you might miss it. Yeah. And you'd yeah. say these aren't very cheesy. It's like a cheap uh, poor man's uh, sponge bob on the front there, winking. <laughs> poor yeah. man's hey. sponge bob. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So these are Korean, I see. They are Korean, yeah. um, and they, the brand pa Paldo, fun and yum. Ooh. Fun and yum together yeah. at last. Well, this Fun is. Life. I mean, this is typically fun. Look at these big slices of uh, Swiss cheese on the noodle. Crazy. That's a serving suggestion. But, right? you know, yeah. you might think, oh, this is some kind of novelty item and it's disgusting, you yeah. know, in its very essence. Mm. Maybe not. Paldo make another noodle that I'm very fond of called the, the Goom Tang. 
the Goom- which is a beef oh, oriental flavour. The Goomtang rats. Goomtang, which is a very is a classy noodle. Okay. So I'm the having I've got high hopes for this, and <laughs> this will be in the in the Eli's box, obviously, but also on. Uh, Upcoming episodes of our Cheap Show podcast, I will be tasting this on the Cheap Eats section. So, little <laughs> plug there. You've just admitted it was cheap. It, it was cheap. It was very cheap. Next up, we have... Oh, good. What the God. hell is that? It's a, it's a boiled child who is strangling a rabbit. <laughs> uh, extremely sunburned as well, isn't it? I, I thought you'd like this, uh, Stu. Uh... You were wrong. You were so, <laughs> so wrong. I mean, you talk about, you know, bad paint jobs. Look at that. This is some dead stock from some toy company in Mexico in the 1940s. That really has strangled the rabbit. Uh, yeah. It's a rabbit. Did you hang it from a Christmas tree? Oh, God, it actually. I thought it was just broken and there were bits rattling around inside. Okay. Also holding weird metal flowers. I'm very scared by this box. It's getting it's, worse. It's, it's, but, come um, on. That's great. Who wouldn't want that in their box? <laughs> <laughs> also, they got a pair of testicles around the neck. Oh, God. Yes. Yes. <laughs> uh, my ex used to live with this artist and he collected all strange toys yeah and i found a, a communist toy gave it to him all i got in return was this piece of crap but uh never mind i hate you nigel thank you <laughs> <laughs> nigel the communist toy lover Ooh. what have we got here yeah. what is oh, this oh they're thing? filthy are they? oh, no, they're not filthy muffs. they're slightly dusty oh Can I wear them? those are brats earmuffs brats earmuffs <laughs> should give them back to the brats all right okay they're, They're good, quite aren't they? soothing They're on the ears. I'm liking it, yeah. And you've got. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Quite Come musky. on. Don't be such prudes. It's a bit yeah. of earwax from a dead child. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. so you've got the Bratz logo there. Mm. I, I'm not sure Bratz is really a brand that resonates with the subscription box guys these days. Yeah. Also, filthy things you put near your ears, generally quite low down on the list of well, things. Well, we can on. wash them. Just get some another item out. All right. I'm going to go for. Oh, God. Ooh. Ah! Ulka bitter. It's actually called bitter. Ulka bitter. Ooh, that I bet is. That's you see, nice. you've got lots of taste and bits of chocolate, and um, this is the absolute shizwalulko uh, chocolate. <laughs> it's good. It's what I meant by that. It's yeah, 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 yeah. Shizwalulko. Right. Give it's, it a it's taste. It's wrapped in foil. And you will I like feel this. slightly more. Oh, yeah. Yeah, pistachio it's dark maybe, chocolate yeah. with pistachio, and honestly, it is Ooh. fantastic. And uh, I think all the subscribers will love this. Right. And while you're doing that, I've just noticed we've got this in there. Isn't this the old cassette thing? That's you? right. Wee. Now, I thought I had an idea with this. As you know, this is uh, one item uh, from a modular set. So Wee. It's a holster for your cassettes. Right? Yep. You could give them one of these one month and another one the next month. Then they'd have... <laughs> just connect them and have like a whole bullet belt full then of they'd them. they'd have two and they could get modular on its ass. It's, right? a, it's a pity they'll never have any pissing cassettes because they're well, decades out of date. I could do cassettes. This is how you reel them in, man. Yeah. They, you know, <laughs> you give you... them one of these and then you give them like a cassette the next time and then yeah. they put the cassette in here and they go, that's value. It... Yeah? I can't that's argue. modular value. You've got a real selection here of food and like useless stuff. The chocolate's stuff. all right. The chocolate's yeah. all right. You but like um, again, dark chocolate is a hard sell. People yeah. do like the milky stuff. Classic and... item. Yeah. You know, that's value. Oh, yeah, there's a bangle. Just a, just a bangle? <laughs> there's a bangle. Walk like an Egyptian a, with yeah. this bangle. Is that for your ankle or...? You could put it on your ankle or your wrist or anything. I stole that from a call centre I worked in. <laughs> well, no one was claiming it. Okay. So yeah. there you go. So it might be hard to produce those on mass. Now there's always a t-shirt in one of these. Oh, and yeah, I go for my, oh, my item. God. It's a vest. It is a vest. That's yeah. quality. Look at the blueness oh, of that. That's that's blue. Oh, so it's yeah. quality. It's quality, yeah. And uh, yeah. Come oh, on, it. excellent. Quite generally, it's they'll want a design well. on the front. It's, it's got, got a, a nice ribbed finish. Yeah, ribbed corduroy effect. <laughs> Brilliant. So we've got a pleasure. vest ribbed for her pleasure. And yeah. so what size is that? Is that one size fits all? Uh, yeah, no, I think it's a medium. But, you know, think about this, you know. Uh, one size fits nobody. Is yeah. You could put that on, stick the Bratz earmuffs on and go dancing in the rain. Your Eli in a box then, yes. Joe. You've got your own little Eli. Would you wear that? I don't even want to go near that. That's, that's, <laughs> that's kind of unholy. What I'm else you got in it? Uh, hang on. Fred Thede's Design Classics. It's a classic says Fred Thede. What the hell is that? Is it's, that a plug? it's a plug. It's a rubber plug. <laughs> With no chain. For a sink, yeah? Just a plug. Well, just... it's a design classic. You know, you display that on your wall. It was made in 1998. Yes. And it's interesting, the retro style design. And made in England, you're guaranteed that it won't last. Thede also was the name of the capital city of Naboo in uh, Star Wars The F***. Thank you. Which I have no so, idea. That's a number 52 plug. 
Oh, wow. That's classic. very rare. You know, you yeah. get a number 51 plug, that's, you know, 52. That's that's interesting. Right, I've, got, I've doubled up on the noodles. Now, you may remember this, because uh, I've mentioned them before. This yeah. is the absolute bad boy noodle by Nissen, who are, like, up there, right? This is your black garlic oil tonkotsu flavour. That is a beaut. Yeah? Yeah, you make black it. Black garlic oil? You've, yeah, it's got nice. a little sachet of black garlic oil in there. That's it. Yeah, beautiful. Put a little egg with it, like you were saying. You put some egg. You 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 pimp that bitch with the spring onions. Although I haven't tried the cheese, this I I can guarantee is delicious. So you know, there's some value there. And it's from Nissan, so not only do they make cars, they also make. Yes, it used to be Datsun noodles. I remember those days. Datsun cherry. Super Bowl. Super Bowl. What the heck is that? It's a bouncy ball. Oh, it feels quite hard, Robert. Wow, extremely bouncy. Yep. Uh, Super Bowl is the original 1950s uh, bouncy ball toy product. Yeah, you could take someone's eye out. You know, mm. toys used to be good. Toys like used to be darts. actual dangerous. It's quite heavy for the I've got to say, for, well, but... for 50 pounds, this is starting to look a bit like a bargain. What you the heck is this? That is a Game Boy Color game. Oh, Game Boy Color. It's a good one. Mary Kate and Ashley's Winner's Circle. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. They're 1998 the Nintendo. Yep, they've got some horses. They're in a circle. One of them's winning. Does it come with a Game Boy Color? Do you, I mean, are you no. trying to push that? No. They, they okay. do actually put Game Boy Color games in some of the nostalgia boxes. So really? there, there is a precedent for That's this. That's why I chose the market. See, I've done yeah. my research. Come okay. on. It, it's a terrifying picture. It looks like they're bursting out of another dimension. It does, not it? Like, <laughs> surprise! <laughs> Riding horses out, out of the yeah, ether. They came out as eternal beings from the other side of reality, didn't they, recently? I um, thought that was Mel and Kim. Oh, yeah, Mel and yeah. Kim. So. Yeah. Okay. Oh, sachets of ketchup. We've got some ketchup packets. Oh, in there. yeah. Always good. Is that to, uh, no, look at that. Those I mean, are quite unusual. Rare. Yeah, it's rare. And uh, <laughs> I thought I could uh, have a little description in the box of where I got those. I got those, I got those from the cafe next to the Thames Barrier. <laughs> Fantastic. So it's like... It's, it's quite niche. Site-specific uh, ketchup packets. <laughs> A yeah, bit of like, a logistic problem. Like? I'm not talking about fucking amplitude. <laughs> well, that can my problem your noodles, here is, What's your problem? Yeah, what? your, right, you're sending this through the post. They're going to get squashed. You're going to end up with everything covered in ketchup. I'll refund them. <laughs> going to spray ketchup love all over the other ones. <laughs> right, so that didn't... Yeah, there's some good stuff in there. Let's, it can end up looking like on. a blood stain if it's We're not even at the bottom yet. Oh, my God, what the... Right, we've got here... A balloon. A balloon. Oh, I used to love it's one of those ones. Yeah, balloon. look. Yeah, look at the nostalgia and the like... joy my box is bringing. Look, oh. at, look at the filth encrusted. I was going to blow it up, but I ain't, I ain't putting no. that in, the, wow. in any way, shape, or form. It's one of those rocket balloons. Yeah, yeah, well, yep. you, you blow it up and it just shoots off so, the straw. Yeah, and then gets stuck in the dog's eye or something and upsets everybody. Yeah. <laughs> Not again, Baxter. That, that is. That is um... <laughs> That's value. Look at the fun to be had. May I suggest that you perhaps do get some of the dirt off it before you send it to people? All right. What else you got in there? Oh, uh, mustard. A mustard as well <laughs> to go with the ketchup. <laughs> now, is this from a unique location or? No, that's from the same location. Okay. Yeah. Great, great. Yeah. Oh my God, a crack! <laughs> <laughs> it's not for crack. Is this for smoking Oxo cubes? Yeah, or? it's for smoking yeah. tobacco products. That's it. Okay. 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 And it's all Nate. It's carved. But, you know, where did you get that? It looks like it's from a little leprechaun. It's funny you say that. Yes, it, it's it's called uh, Maguire's leprechauns. <laughs> Not really. Look quiet. <laughs> it's an Irish name. So we're not only getting shoddy merchandise, we're getting appalling lies. Yeah. As well. yeah. Amazing. Uh, you said that oh, we've got a, a pin badge. badge. Stuart. Yeah. Right. And it's a metal one. It's a bit of quality, that, isn't it? Happy New Year. Happy New Year 2008 from Outback. <laughs> is that like a restaurant? Is that the Outback? It is a restaurant. In America, the Outback yes. restaurants. Oh, they're good, the they are. It's Australian themed. Do you like yeah, those? Yeah, they're nice. Do you know what they're famous for? Uh, steak? A blooming onion. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. Which is yeah, a deep-fried nice. onion in a petal shape. It flowers out. Mm. It flowers out and it's mm. deep-fried. They should have put that on their badge. That would have been awesome. Well, what have you actually got on the depicted there uh, on that badge? Like a baby... Running it's away a koala from its, and there's a, God. God is a koala, I think. Oh, no, no, I think this is the old, that's the old year, that's the new year. And they are koalas. In koala right? form. Yes, yeah, good. Yeah. Right. This was made at the pin centre, as they're very keen on repeatedly telling you on the back. <laughs> just in case you didn't know, it. pin centre. It's yeah. a quality item, that. Um, <laughs> is there anything else? I we just, have uh, oh two other things. I might as well pull them out at once. Is that a novelty eraser? We, yes. we have a, yeah, a, a sandwich. A novelty sandwich eraser. Now, that's classy. It's... Do you know this is the one thing that might get this going? Yeah. I think yeah. whenever I've it's used erasers hard. like that, they never tend to work. They no, just look, it, they well, look it's, it's not awesome. Produce, it's yeah. not for rubbing out your mistakes with. Oh, no. Barry. Just leave it in the packet. It is in itself a mistake. Yeah. 
He says tomato and lettuce and some bread in this uh, collectible jolly Japanese. Uh, I think my, my, there's all sorts of dirt under my fingernails from this box now. That's amazing. <laughs> Thanks, yeah. Eli. It comes with sanitizer as well. <laughs> <laughs> it could do if yeah. you want yeah. it. Yeah. That that is a heck of a thing. There you go. From Iwako.com. That's good. Now what have you got there? Oh, I actually support this. This is a Biscoff. Lotus oh bit. yes, really that's nice. a, that would be good in the box because you can't yeah. get those in the shops. You can get them from that. only only from like certain coffee shops. Yeah, and you yeah. never know before you've ordered in there whether they, you're going to get one of these or yeah. not. You might get and if you do, you might you're overjoyed. A... So yeah. whoever little geeky crackhead who's opening this bloody box is that the target market? Is that yeah, yeah. That, that explains well, the point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's well, you have to be on crack to enjoy Winner's Circle, don't you? Well, I would buy this box for that alone. There's right. um, biscoffy. Look at that. That's that's bloody. Quality, I've got yeah, two questions about this uh, biscuit. They do a biscuit yes, spread as well. <laughs> nice. And you could potentially win one of 5,000 Minu coffee machines. Oh, beautiful. So that, that really so is astonishing. Yeah. Get those codes that they send out in the boxes for games and stuff. Yeah, there we are. Wow. Put that code into Steam and a biscuit might come out your CD drive. <laughs> Doesn't work on Mac. And that is um, the last item. So what do you think, guys? Well, did you know that you can buy entire packets of these in Poundland, like really big ones? Uh, any other deflating comment you want to say yeah. about the stuff in my... I mean, yeah, the, the muff's a bit smelly. Um, yeah. The muff can, doesn't have to be smelly. I know that. Oh, the sorry. muff... <laughs> yeah, I can clean my muff, okay. all right? Work, on, work on the muff yeah. and maybe come I mean, back to us again. So it's a no. Look it, how it's... modular this is. <laughs> but how many of them do you actually have? I have an infinite amount of them. You do not have an infinite I've amount of I've got five of, of them. Five of them. Five of them. But it, so what happens if you get 15 orders in a month? And people... I, I rejoice and I employ someone to make these. But like a 3D <laughs> printer. Yeah, get a 3D printer. So anything's possible if you're not such a naysayer. Eli's box could be a... I'm just sick of, sick of trying to convince you guys of this bullshit. You know, I'm going to go, I'm going to go do, do my own box. You just did. That's what this was. I'll show it to somebody who likes it. <laughs> Honestly, just throw it away. It's fine. I'm keeping the rubber. <laughs> yeah, I quite like these muffs actually. I'm gonna have the Game Boy Color game as well. Might have some resale value. And I'm gonna grab Eli's ball. No, get it! Get off the fucking ball! <laughs>、that's value. That's argue. modular value. Classic item. That's value. That's、yeah. quality. There's some value there. That's value. <laughs> it's a bit of quality, that, isn't it? It's a、yeah. quality item, that. Now, that's, that's classy. That's bloody quality. Who wouldn't want that in their box?